am Shiva from The Local Rose, and today we're going to discuss one of my favorite topics, which is non-toxic beauty. And today I have a friend, an incredible makeup artist, Sarah mm -hmm. Maxwell, with me. We are going to sort of go through the journey of exploring a lot of these incredibly new uh, non-toxic products that don't have phthalates and parabens exactly. and all these uh, hormone-altering toxic chemicals. Because this is a subject that I'm really passionate about because if you eat processed food, if you go and eat a hamburger at you know, some fast food place, actually your liver can break down the toxic chemicals. But when you put on toxic chemicals on your skin, there's really no filter. So our largest organ is sort of absorbing all of these chemicals. And now there's so many lovely lines, like from living libations and RMS and vapor. And so we're gonna sort of show you that you can create glamorous, incredible makeup looks using these non-toxic items. I'm excited. I'm excited too. <laughs> <laughs> so what are we gonna start with? Do you do foundation first on me? So we're gonna start with actually your <gasps> um, glow face balm. The good thing about makeup is it needs to stick kind of to each other. So if you want a lasting makeup, you kind of want a few layers. So it's made with coconut, shea butter, uh, frankincense, rose, yeah. and it just feeds your skin. So it's basically like giving your skin food. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to apply it all over Shiva's skin, kind of like our, our version of a primer. Okay. So next on Shiva, I'm using the Vapor Organic Beauty Soft Focus Foundation. I'm going to be using a Real Techniques brush found, and I think it's great because it buffs the product really nicely into the skin. I really like the consistency. It's like one of the first foundations I've found. It's kind of incredible, like you have all these choices. If you have a choice to use one without these chemicals like phthalates and parabens, why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't you? Okay, so now we're gonna go in with one of Shiva's favorites, RMS, and it's the Uncover cover-up in number 22. And then we're also gonna use the Sigma brush. I like a nice fluffy brush to do a concealer so it's almost like soft focus buffed into any sort of um, discoloration on the face. And this is Sigma's new cruelty-free vegan brush set. It nice. just came out. The RMS, again, it's using coconut base. So you're actually feeding your skin nice with too. coconut. Yeah. Again, it smells good and the colors great. are so amazing. Like the Living Luminizer, I use that all the time. Yeah. And it's all I have. I have like those two brands are just uh, goddesses. <laughs> and so I'm just gonna go in when there's any kind of redness, maybe around the nose. A lot of people get that there. So a lot of people, you know, get a little discoloration under the eyes. I'm just gonna go in very lightly with this product, just buffing it in. I'm a little intimidated by eyes, I have to say. Like, I just put on a little mascara if I'm going yeah. to a red carpet, and that's it, because I don't know, you know, how to exactly to apply do it. To do it, exactly. Okay, so we'll go it. through that. <laughs> so what I always like to do is start with the, br the brow. So we don't have to necessarily put anything through it, but just a little brush. The RMS Master Mixer. And I think this product is kind of like an all kind of purpose. So you could use it as like a highlighter, oh, cool. maybe a little bit on the lip. Okay. You could mix it in with a foundation. But for today, I'm gonna actually just pop it on the lid. Mm -hmm. And then I think this will be great with some of the pigments that I'm gonna that I've it's gonna be really nice and delicious. And we have a new line to both Shiva and myself, which we're kind of dying over. Oh, Ritu the packaging. It's called Ritual Defi, which is cute. like girl ritual. Exactly. Which is all Super about cute. what I I think beauty is a, should be about exactly. The ritual. I'm just gonna take a little bit on this brush, and I'm just gonna pack it in, kind of place it on what we already um, put there. And because of the goldenish tone to it, it's really gonna bring out the green in Shiva's eyes and just brighten it ever so slightly. Yeah. There's so many vibrant colors that um, these brands are able to put in coming from nature. Next, I'm just gonna lightly line Shiva's lash line <laughs> with the Vapor Organic. And this one is kind of like plummy brown kind of color, which again is gonna bring out that green in her eyes. And I don't want it to be like a heavy line. I just want it to accentuate. So I'm just gonna push it in to her lash line. And we're gonna go in with one a mascara that you're really My into. My favorite. Rosemary Swift, again, from RMS, has created a mascara that feeds your lashes. It has vitamin E, shea butter, um, and I think some coconut, perhaps. But it's just, uh, what an amazing novel idea. You're actually feeding your lashes rather than drying them out. So that's just like a nice, soft eye that Shiva can wear like throughout the day, when she has meetings, different things like that. Next, we're gonna go back in to the final, final touches on the skin and we're gonna do this really amazing cream blush from Ritual Defi in Lovesick. 
And then we're gonna do a vapor illuminating stick in Hallow Moonlight. Mm. Both fun names. I like that. I love stick under the Hallow Moonlight. <laughs> okay, so, so we're just going to pop a little bit on, because remember cream blushes are really saturated, so you wanna be mindful of like how much you put on, and it's just gonna kind of be in the apple area, just so it's like flush over that <gasps> love. Flush over that love, <laughs> under the halo of his moonlight. <laughs> and sometimes what I like to do too is a little trick to give that youthfulness. I kind of go over the bridge of the nose and wow. down, so it's kind of like. I didn't know that. <laughs> like a little sun kissed almost, do you know what I mean? Uh -huh. Finally, we're gonna finish Shiva's look with the Living Libation, and I have to say, it's it's one of the best smelling oh, products. Smells divine. So we're gonna do the Pink Lady Lip Shimmer. It's like a lip balm. I love her products. She uses jojoba, grapefruit, neroli, lavender, rose, like all sorts of yummy ingredients. And Nadine's just an incredible alchemist. And for her, philosophy is all about how to stay juicy. And how to how we stay juicy is by putting products that, that help that. Rather than drying us out, these things are gonna promote that. Yeah, because it has a great pigment you can see on the back of my hand and the slip is like really nice too for a lip product because it is kind of an, an unfortunate thing that happens with lip products. They kind of like Dry end up drying you out. You can it almost smell, smell that well, oxygen. Well, there's oxygen yeah. in it because you might smell and go, oh my God, what is that that smell? It's unusual, but it's got oxygen, so it's actually feeding your cells oxygen, which is another brilliant idea. And you can also put it on your cheeks too. You're making me smile. <laughs> <There we go. laughs> I'm blushing. <laughs> So there's Shiva's final look. And I have to say, like as a makeup artist, you always want to try to find products that are going to have a good payoff, that your clients are going to like, that are going to last throughout the day. And all of the brands that we use today really do the trick. Mm. And they're good for you. And I feel so great about wearing them. Yeah, and your skin probably feels... Mm. Feels better. Yeah. Feels better. Thank you to all of you, and thank you to you. <laughs> and I can't wait to go look at what I look like now. Yes. <laughs>